Now, one thing I'm learning about New York is that people are bringing all types of fierce, and I couldn't help but notice Tammy bringing the fierce all the way from Ohio and Atlanta all the way to New York. Tammy, how are you doing? I am doing fabulous. How are you doing, cutie pie? <laughs> I'm doing good. I want you to give me a 12 because this floral skirt is amazing. Now, what inspired this look today? I love Bessie Johnson. Um, I love like flirty, fun, girly outfits. And so a designer in Atlanta made this for me. Just, just for New York Fashion yes. Week? Yes, I got it back like two days ago. <laughs> Amazing. Now, are you going to be going to any shows? Or you yes, I have a lot of shows um, lined up. I just left the Tracy Reese show, and I have some more shows this evening. And I have a little break, so my photographer, we're just out here shooting. Having a ball in the cold! <laughs> I'm absolutely loving your energy. Now, if you had to describe your outfit and your style in three words, what would it be? Fun, flirty, and sexy. This is Tammy from Atlanta. I'm Mercedes Benson and we're here at New York Fashion Week. Woo! <laughs> Hello and welcome to Spice TV. Now, I have bumped into a lovely gentleman here called Askia. Askia, what brings you here to New York Fashion Week? Um, the shows and all the fashion. I love the, sh um, <laughs> the style watch. People yeah. just walk past and I'm actually really waiting on my friend. <laughs> I'm just out here in the cold, so. Now you mentioned star watching and I've been doing a bit of star watching myself, which is why I came to you. Talk us through your outfit today. Okay, so I'm wearing H&M <laughs> and it's a bit of a tartan kind of mad scientist look. Yeah. And I just love like to clash like, you know, kind of somewhat GQ looks and, you know, street, cause I'm so like, I love high end street wear, so. It's always me. And um, my biker jacket is actually from a vintage shop back in Atlanta. You mentioned as well H&M and vintage stores. Do you think the high street and vintage store fashion is really important or do you think um, everyone should be going for like the designer high end? Um, I, well honestly, where however you can rock it, I feel just do it, but I love the whole, um, I love, I, I shop sales racks and vintage shops and all that. And I love high end as well, but I'm, I mostly go for, you know, vintage sales racks. It's more unique that way, isn't it? Cause you find more bargains and everything, right? Exactly. And I love getting more, not just one piece. So yeah. I'm all for the bargains. <laughs> now, if you had to name your style icon, who would it be and why? Gosh, I love Pharrell. He never ages. I love Pharrell. Pharrell is my ultimate style icon. I love him. It, it's just because, like, he's so daring and it's different and he he just goes for it. Yeah. Now, he did wear that controversial hat at the Grammys. Would you wear it yourself? But I actually <laughs> love it because I love Vivian Westwood too. So, <laughs> yes, I will wear it. Thank you so much for talking to You're us. Welcome. Hi, my name is Askel Abdul and we're here at New York Fashion Week and you're watching Spice TV. Now I bumped into a lovely lady who's bringing a lot of colour into this outfit. What's your name and what are you doing here at New York Fashion Week? I'm Alexa, I'm a fashion blogger and I just came from Katia Soul's show. Now I'm loving the pop of colour here with the blue pumps and the pink blazer. Talk us through your outfit today. Um, so the blazer is from H&M and the skirt is Topshop and the shoes are actually from Aldo. Now Topshop's actually from London and I'm hearing that you New Yorkers are absolutely loving it. Tell us why. I don't know, it just has a different, like New York has a certain distinct sense of style, but London has its own life about it. So that's why I really like it. It just gives you something new to wear. Oh, amazing. I'm loving that. This is out for you, Londoners. And um, if you had to describe your style in three words, what would it be? Um, I guess I'd say feminine. I'd say a little whimsical on occasion and sometimes dark when it needs to be. Awesome. <laughs> now, tell us where we can find you in your blog once more. My blog is Lex Loves Couture, so LexLovesCouture.com. Awesome. Thank you so much for talking to us, Lex. Now we're here at the Lincoln Centre and I have managed to capture the star goddess herself, June Ambrose. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Now, your, like, your outfit is just dazzling and your hat game is fabulous. Talk us through your outfit today. Well, I'm wearing Marc Jacobs, YSL. Um, I have a little, I have a fur on fur. You know, there's like this little goodies in here. <laughs> You know, a little Fendi Amazing. inside of my uh, Tracy Alexandra. Uh, my hat is custom designed. My hat is my own. And my coat is Givenchy. Now, yeah. you are the biggest style 
stylist in the game right now. Could you give any advice to just any upcoming stylists out there? Yeah, I, you know, I think it's really important that you carve out your, your lane and you stay in it and you work really hard to kind of set yourself apart. Um, you know, hard work, dedication, I mean, it's a different business now it's very competitive so yes. you have to be really on your a game all the time yeah. you will not sleep you will not sleep <laughs> you sleep, will not not sleep. sleep. Okay. but it'll be worth it in the long run and a style tip for anyone out there as well um, you know I always say you know wear things and buy things that you love because those are the things that you're gonna play with and reinterpret time and time again Amazing. thank you so much Jean for spending time with us this is Spice TV I was blown away by a dazzling lady here called Iram. Iram, how are you? I'm fine. Freezing, but fine. <laughs> You're still looking amazing, even in the cold. I'm trying to look amazing <laughs> in the cold, right? Now, talk us through your outfit today. Actually, my whole outfit is Sarah. <gasps> me oh, too. I've got everything Sarah on me. from the shoes, except from uh, for the back, which is Fiore. It's uh, an Italian uh, brand. But everything is Sarah, and this is vintage. It was my mother's, yeah. like from the 70s, oh, wow. and I still have it. Yeah. <laughs> now, how important is it to you to be able to shop at maybe a lower price point compared to the designers? Because you say you shop in Zara, so yeah, it's a uh, super. Uh, it's superb. It's like uh, everyone should have like the opportunity to dress uh, trendy, to dress well, and places like Zara, Forever 21, Mango. You have like um, trendy pieces uh, for less of the, of the price of a uh, designer. Yeah. Although a designer is like you have yeah. e something unique, you feel like you have to, to take care of it more. But I like I like this. I like and the designers also like like that too. It's you can true. see Peter Piloto that recently yesterday uh, launched uh, his line for Target. So uh, even though even they like it, amazing. Now, if you had to give a style tip for everyone out there, what would it be? Uh, be real and just dress like you like. Don't um, follow all the trends. The trends are not for all of us. Just pick what goes with your personality. Thank you so much, Iran, for talking to us. It's Vice TV. Now I'm envying your coat right about now because it's absolutely freezing here. <laughs> Introduce yourself to Spice TV. Hello, my name is Maddox. Now I'm absolutely loving your outfit today. Talk us through it. Uh, my pants are from Zara. My coat is from J. Crew. Um, the double-breasted blazer is from uh, Club Monaco. Um, the shirt is Burberry. Awesome. Now everyone's loving Zara at the moment. Loads of people seem to be having pieces. Why do you think they're just such a hit right now? Um, Zara is pretty affordable. Uh, you know, it gives you a you know European style. And I like the, the way they're tailored. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. And are you looking forward to any shows here at New York uh, Fashion Week? Um, yes, I'm going to the J Crew show tomorrow. Uh, I'm also going to a show on uh, Tuesday from a line from Paris. Amazing. Yes. And I have to ask you this question: Are you a trendsetter or a trend follower? I would call myself a trendsetter. Um, I don't really have any any anyone that that um, influences my style. Um, so yeah, I would definitely call myself a trendsetter. Thank you so much for talking to us, Maddox. This is Spice TV. I'm joined by a very bespoke looking man just here. What's your name? Introduce yourself. My name is Gregory. I'm known as Art of a Stylist. Now, Art of a Stylist, how long have you been styling for? Um, probably about three or four years now. It started out uh, as a hobby. Uh, I just started out putting together different looks when I was about 14 or 15. My mom was deployed to Iraq oh, and wow. I just got good at it and she said I can get paid so I came to New York. Amazing. How are you finding New York so far? I love New York. When I actually came here I started doing some personal shopping and work for clients with Kohan and I just been doing a lot of stuff with a lot of people ever since. Now I love your outfit. I'm loving the way you're just playing around with textures and patterns. Talk us through it today. Okay so uh, my shoes are Kohan. Uh, my, my pants and my sweater is Club Monaco. My blazer is Zara and Ralph Lauren is the pocket square. And your hat game as well, where's that from? This is from a vintage store in, uh, in Soho, I believe it was. I got a lot of fedoras, so I, I can't remember yeah. if this one is from, from Soho or Williamsburg. Williamsburg and Soho, are those the best places to go for when you want to go vintage shopping in New York? Vintage, yeah, it's definitely Williamsburg. I'm really not a, a, a vintage shopper, but for certain yeah. pieces, the vintage places definitely have it. 
Now, could you give some top styling tips for the men out there? Just go with, with the fit. It's all about the fit. So it doesn't it doesn't have to look well. But it's not about baggy stuff no, anymore. It's not. If okay. it fits well, then you can go with it. Amazing. Lovely speaking to you. Thank you, Mr. This is Spice TV. My name is Gregory. I'm known as Art of a Stylist, and I'm here at New York Fashion Week, and you're watching Spice TV.